beautiful day here in paradise. What's going on guys? How's it going? Mark from 408. Welcome to Toby Tuesday. So it's been a busy, busy week trying to catch up with work since I'm taking off. If you're watching this right now, I'm actually already gone. I'm in Michigan. So I'll be in Michigan all week ripping and tearing. So we were out last night breaking cars. We didn't actually get the Maverick out last night, surprising. So we, uh, we jumped the, what did we jump? We jumped the Jeep. We were teeter-tottering the van and I think the tranny's starting to go. So maybe we'll jump that later tonight. Um, yeah, other than that, I just gotta take all those cars back to the scrapyard. So yeah, it's been busy, 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 that's for sure. So um, yeah, there's been a ton of questions. I did a live chat on YouTube the other day. So basically on my app, I can see all the recent comments from all 15 or 1600 videos. So it's nice. So when I do the live chat, I, I said, anyone that comments within the next hour on any video on my channel, I'll respond to. So it went well, there was, uh, there was a ton of comments. So everyone was happy I responded. And then, uh, you know, after that hour, I had to get going and do other stuff, but uh, yeah, it went super well. So I think I'm gonna do that once a week, just do a live chat. Plus obviously I'll still do Toby Tuesday. So I'll, I'll also use some of those questions to answer for in Toby Tuesday, but. Yeah, so I gotta wash this thing up probably later today because we're she's gonna be loaded up. I'll load her all up tomorrow and then take her to Michigan with me. Got a freshy belt. These things aren't cheap. It's crazy, eh? I mean, I, I only paid 150 for it, but it's still, it's aggressive for a belt. Are, are the are the side-by-side uh, -side belts the same as the snowmobile belts? It just says performance belt on it. There's no like serial number or anything, so. I don't know. Anyways, let's head over to the barn. We'll grab Toby and we'll uh, answer you guys' questions. Tobes, what are you doing? Let's go fry. Go, go, Tobes. <laughs> hey, buddy. How's it going? Sunny, sunny days with Toby. I'm just waiting for him to one day hit the gas and run me over with this thing. <laughs> hey, buddy, you wouldn't do that. You wouldn't do that, would you? Hey? <laughs> oh, Toby. Joby. It is definitely beautiful out here today. This is our sand ring where the horses do horse things. Hey Tobes, do you get up there? <laughs> I had to lift them up here. They're just an old boy. Sit down. Come on, sit. Sit. <laughs> Tobes, what are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? You gonna chill with me for a little bit? Hey? I'm a little nervous. No, stay up here. <laughs> Sit down, Tobes. All right, questions. Questions and comments for you, Tobes. Hey, just relax. <laughs> He's a little nervous. Toby, hey. Okay, I'll put you down. Don't run anywhere, though. All right, he's relaxed now. <clears throat> questions and comments. Um, I need your foot, Tobes. Need a paperweight. <laughs> um, first one from Slimy Boss. You should do some tug of wars or drag racing with the cars at the track. Yeah, we probably will. Um, it has been a busy few weeks, so obviously I only have, I think, two cars that run right now, and the trannies are both starting to go, so I'm probably not gonna do any tug of wars with those. I'm basically just waiting to jump them. But uh, definitely when I get back from Michigan, I'll uh, try and line up a whole bunch more cars and we'll, uh, we'll get her going. I gotta take all those cars back. I just gotta dedicate a day to taking all those cars back. It's time, for sure. So, But we will definitely line that up. Hey buds, you wanna drag race some cars? No, you don't care? <laughs> um, Mads TV. Sorry, it's a little breezy here. Um, when are you going to jump the Subaru? Well, the, Ju the Subaru crapped out on us so we um yeah i don't know what was wrong with it or maybe some safety switch or something but uh we never figured it out a youtube tutorial everything i looked everything up um a few people had suggestions but we looked into it and couldn't figure it out so i just took it back to scrap got my money back so actually i got more money for it so i'm happy i got more money than what i bought it for off uh, kijiji so um, happy Dylan Hamill, you should buy a golf cart and ramp it. Well, I have a golf cart already, it's right there. 
I don't think it goes fast enough to ramp it. But um, yeah, if someone has a golf cart and they want to jump it, you kind of need a faster one because this one would basically just roll over, roll over the jump, right? It wouldn't be too interesting. But if someone has a golf cart or has any suggestions, let me know. Um, another jump question, Jacob Russell. Would you ever considering consider jumping an old ATV? Oh man, it's been today. Um, yeah, of course. I don't have any old ATV. Well, I have my KTM, but I'm not gonna jump it. But as I said before, if you guys have any ATVs or cars or anything old you want to see jumped, bring it over and we'll get it jumped. So I'm up for jumping anything. You want to jump anything, Tobes? It is so nice out today. It is nice. Isn't it nice, Tobes? <laughs> you having fun? Miss John? We're almost done, Tobes. We're almost done. <laughs> We're almost done. Don't you worry. You need to brush him. Every time I brush this dog, there's like another handful of hair. Ugh. Ugh. Hair everywhere. Toby. Yeah, hair everywhere. So nice so, out. Oh, I can't wait for this week to end so I can load up and get out of here. It's been so busy. And Brian. Doing Brian things. Yeah, I've been so busy and I'm I'm still healing from my crash there the other day. Tobes. Oh. <laughs> See, that's what happens when when I don't keep an eye on Tobes. Anyways, we'll wrap this up anyways. Um what else? Yeah, I'm excited. So, I'm going to try and film a lot more this year than I did last year at the farm. I got a few videos last year, but this year I'm going to try and make uh one almost every day, basically. So it's basically just gonna be a lot of side-by-side -side touring stuff. So, and we golf, we paddleboard up there, but I'll mostly just film the side-by-side -side stuff, so. Anyways, last question, Cameron Walrath. What made you start a YouTube career and why do you stop racing? Um, well, I actually started YouTube before I finished racing. Um, yeah, I just kinda eased into it. And I just, I had the channel because I was just making videos and I didn't wanna burn DVDs for my friends anymore. So I just threw them on there and sent them the link and then um youtube came out with the partnership program in 2009 so i applied i got it and i started making money from there and i went to film school and stuff so i didn't want to work for anyone like i didn't want to make movies or anything so that's why i chose a youtube route. and i quit racing because i was just over it you know i worked my way up to pro and in canada it's a bit of a joke and like if you won pro i think top prize was like 150 bucks maybe so it just wasn't worth my time anymore and it was just so hard on my body and being away like you're gone every weekend racing you know i missed a ton of events birthdays and all that stuff so you know i did it for six seven years and i had my time and then i just i got over it It wasn't fun anymore right in junior year it was so much fun you know we were competitive we'd have a great time and then by pro you're just training 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 and breaking stuff every weekend and then you gotta go home fix stuff train all week like it just wasn't, I just didn't enjoy it anymore. So that's why I kind of wrapped her up. Plus it was so expensive too. I don't feel like spending, you know, 500 to a thousand bucks a weekend on hotels, gas, parts, entry fees. So, you know, can't, can't do it forever. So, but the snow bikes was fun too. I didn't have to pay for any of that, but uh, you know, it's still, still gone a lot. And uh, you know, dedicating yourself and always training and stuff. So anyways, I'm going to wrap this up for now. I knew, uh, Renda Lennon and I got a whole bunch of stuff to do today and then hopefully we can jump a car tonight Hopefully hopefully we'll see See what goes on see where the guys are so I'm trying to get Brad back But he's been so busy with work and family stuff So he'll be in some videos too for you guys. that love Brad Brad Justin. So thank you guys as always make sure you check out the links below leave some nice comments and uh, Keep an eye on my story because I'm gonna do another live chat soon. So thank you guys again We'll see you later